action. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it, all right? <laughs> <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one, okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh, Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Why are y'all playing with Will Smith? Y'all turn one of the greatest actors of our time into a meme. There's a meme of Will Smith crying. He's shedding tears because he's like, baby, I love you. Why are you doing this to me? Every man in America has two rules. Don't embarrass me and do not intentionally try to hurt me. Because if you do, you're going to turn me into O.J. Simpson. The body of 34-year-old Nicole Brown Simpson, ex-wife of O.J. Simpson, was found after midnight. And right now we're watching Will Smith turn to O.J. Simpson. Every man has a breaking point. I don't think you remember O.J. Simpson. He was America's favorite, most nicest black man until that white woman kept playing with his ass. And when he got tired of uh, uh, Nicole, whatever her name was, playing with him, he went to work. <laughs> and it wasn't on no movie set. He got busy. Simpson is arrested and charged with murder. He got acquitted and everybody, everybody cheered. Every black person in America, they started clapping. Hey, that man got acquitted. Are you going to clap when you see Will Smith going down the freeway in a black Tahoe? Because back then I was in elementary school and OJ Simpson, he was in a white Bronco. <laughs> the Bronco is not popping right now. And so you're going to see Will Smith going down, the, uh, going down the highway in a white Tahoe because he couldn't control his hoe. <laughs> Can't no man control no woman. Jada Pinkett, she's not controlling herself. Herself. She's using all of her power to try to tear Will Smith down. And as she's trying to tear him down, he's trying to big her up. He's trying to build his career, make more money so he can increase his lineage. But she's trying to tear down this man's legacy. Why? Because who is Jada Pinkett? From my frame of reference, the last time Jada Pinkett had a good movie, it was a low down, dirty shame with Keenan Ivory Waynes. And it's a low down, dirty shame what Jada Pinkett is trying to do to Will Smith. She's trying to tear him down and end his career because she's jealous. Jealousy is a tragedy. When you can't control who I am as a human being, you want to try to tear me down. Everyone laughs when a woman tries to tear a man down. They think that stuff is funny. But what happens when a man fights back? Nicole's throat slashed. She was nearly decapitated. You tell a man right now in modern America, he can't fight back against no woman because he ain't got no power. That means that every modern man is subservient to woman right now in this society. And so when you look back at O.J. Simpson and how all that turned out. It was five days earlier when his ex-wife, Nicole Simpson, and her friend Ron Goldman were discovered murdered. Nicole's throat slashed. She was nearly decapitated outside her condominium. You watch the man who couldn't salvage his career turn into a savage. And as soon as Will Smith can no longer salvage his career, he's going to turn into a savage. Would you say she has been instrumental in you and I redefining our relationship? I would say don't just start filming me without asking me. Oh, my goodness. If you could film Astaire, me. Astaire, come help us again, please. I'm still dealing with foolishness. Don't. No, nah, no, nah, she, yeah, because she don't just. Would you say that she helped us heal the hurts that we caused between one another? My social media presence is my bread and butter, okay? So you can't just use me for social media and not, you know, don't just start rolling. I'm standing in my house. Don't just start rolling. And you're going to be like, dang, I can't believe Will Smith went out like that. You shouldn't have been laughing at him. Every man in America who laughs at Will Smith, it's a shame. You're a shameful, your behavior, because I know you experienced it before. Every man in America who has dated a woman, you understand what heartbreak is. You know what it feels like when a woman embarrasses you. You know what it feels like when she humiliates you in front of the whole public or in front of your family. When she tries to hurt you intentionally, you just look at her like, damn. Why'd you do that? That hurt me a whole lot. That's all you can say. Every man in America, if you get into a compromising position, the only thing that you can say to a woman is, you hurt me. Why did you hurt me? And she gonna look at you like, nigga, fuck you. Do something. <laughs> Knowing damn well that you can't do nothing. 
But if you OJ Simpson, you look at the watch and say, uh, how long does it take for uh the, for them to get here? <laughs> That's how much time you got to get away from me. Cause you better stop playing with me. If we stop playing pretend, then we might be able to save the American family. If we stop acting like we don't understand what gender roles are, that men are strong and women are not physically strong. If we stop pretending like we don't understand these physical dynamics when it comes to relationships, then maybe Will Smith wouldn't be in, in this position. Ain't no man on the streets. Hey, there was a time before he slapped Chris Rock. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. He slapped another man. There was a gay man who saw him on the, on a red carpet and tried to play Will Smith. And Will Smith slapped the shit out of him. Hey, man, come on, man. What the hell is your problem, buddy? All right. <laughs> hey, sorry. He said, kiss me in my mouth. He's joking. He's lucky I ain't sucker punching. Oh, sorry. I said that on camera. <laughs> Did we get mad at Will Smith for slapping the shit out of a gay man? Hell no. Did we get mad at Will Smith for slapping the shit out of Chris Rock? Hell no. What y'all gonna do when he turns that energy on Jada Pinkett Smith for playing with his name? Say, don't just start filming me without asking me. Oh, my goodness. What y'all gonna do? Are y'all gonna clap and cheer? Hey, y'all gonna be disgusted because no man is supposed to ever use his real power to defend himself against no woman. And so my question to you is, why in the world do women use all their power to try to take me out, to try to hurt me? That is a violation. Jada Pinkett ain't had no good movie since the low down dirty shame. And for every man who is cheering for Jada Pinkett Smith, it's a shame because you're supposed to stand up for men. And if you right now, if you got something going on in your life, I don't give a shit what you building. If you actually have goals and you're working towards your goals, the woman who's in your life, ask her, hey, what you doing except for having a vagina in between your legs? You either help me or get away from me. If you ain't gonna help me build, then you probably gonna destroy me and I don't wanna be destroyed. So go play with somebody else, bitch. Don't play with me, huh? <laughs> The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive.